It's the Liberty Bank Surprise Squad on Eyewitness News. All right, now on Channel 3, the Liberty Bank Surprise Squad stopped by Mount Southington to meet families hitting the slopes and make their visit a whole lot better. Channel 3's Eva Zamaris explains why the ski trip was especially meaningful for two families. The Liberty Bank Surprise Squad went to Mount Southington with one mission in mind. Make an already great day for families even better. It's going to be a good day. We picked up these vouchers to cover an eight hour rental or anything people were looking to buy. We're going to be excited, definitely. And with that, we were off to the races. I'm Eva with Channel 3. We're part of the Liberty Bank Surprise Squad. We surprised families from both near and far. Oh, it perfect, because we need to run skis. Thank you. Oh. This doesn't just go for rentals. This could be for you whatever you want. Well, I'm going to give this to you. Excellent. Use this for your purchase today. Thank you very much. And while we were there, we came across two families who were there for one very special reason. This is Margaret Blaze and Kelly Albert. We met at CCMC um, on the eighth floor, the oncology floor. Well, my son Connor um, was battling osteosarcoma and receiving treatment, and Margaret's son Alex was battling glioblastoma. We met at clinic, um, and then our sons grew very close together by doing some activities. Then Alex and Connor's sisters also became great friends, but their worlds changed forever when Alex was 12 and Connor was 10. Unfortunately, Connor passed away and Alex passed away. Can you wave? These families still get together when they can, this time ski lessons for the girls. It was a nice way to get them out, get them active, on. Uh, days off from school. It's nice too that we have each other to talk to and, the and also the girls. Other. Yeah, I yeah. think we're bonded for life. Yes, for yeah. sure, for sure. At Mount Southington for the Liberty Bank Surprise Squad, I'm Eva Zamaris, Channel 3 Eyewitness News. It's nice. That is very, very nice.